Welcome to Willy's Wonderland. Spend the night cleaning Willy's Wonderland, and I will pay to have your car fixed. Deal? You are officially on staff. Let's get the hell out of here. I can't stand to hear a grown man scream. This place has a dark history. I know the bullshit story they told you. It's a lie. You're here to be a human sacrifice. Have you been listening to a word I've been saying? He's gonna die in here, but he won't listen to me. Machines got out. Nobody is safe. Put your balls on, Evan. We're going to Willie's. He's not trapped in here with them. They're trapped in here with him. It's your birthday, and we want you to have fun. It's your birthday, so let's go. It's birthday time. I enjoy a man a few words. <laughs> You must heed my words before I'm gone, my son. Now, you will be king. But the throne must pass to a male heir. Hakim, it appears you have a son. He must be found. Prepare the royal chain. We are going back to America. Oh, hell no, your majesty. Come on! I'm back! Say it again! Feel right in his mother... Feel good in his mother... My whole hood in his mother... Come on! Come on! Just in the I'm the king of this shop! That's funny in hell! Well, well... Say it again! It is so good to see you. Well, Abby, damn, look who done come up in here. Hey, it's Kunta Kinte and Ebola. The famine and blood diamonds. Nelson Mandela and Winnie. Those hungry babies with the flies on the face. Hey, oh, 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 that's too much. Oh, now, you oh, stepped yeah. over the line. Now, we won't be talking that kind of shit about the hungry babies. You're going to have to get out of my chair. Politically incorrect. So what you doing back here, Hotel Rwanda? <laughs> 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 I'm back. Say it again. You know him, didn't you? Then you had that one little feeling. But you waved it away. You should have listened to that one little feeling. Just like I'm listening to you now. You can talk to me. I'm all a friend you got. You're not exactly a department favorite. Things probably changed a lot since he left. You still gotta catch him, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not that much has changed then, huh? <laughs> I can assure you all we are taking a 24-7 all-hands-on-deck approach to these cases. The guy's a shark. If he stops, he dies. He likes to drive. Probably has a decent car, maybe two. High mileage. He must really like my car. I do. How's the truck space? Something I gotta know. How's a guy with the best clearance rate in the department work 15 years without a promotion? Maybe I didn't go to the right church. When I look in your eyes, what I see, it ain't good. He knew all the details, but he wasn't within 10 miles of the killing. Why is that? Why is that? Oh, oh. How's the trunk space? What do you want? I want to nail the bastard. For who? 
for all of the girls he killed. I want to nail him too. The difference is, I'm doing it for me. It's the little things, Jimmy. It's the little things that rip you apart. It's the little things that get you caught. Superheroes stand watch when danger closes in and save those in need. But they have one thing in common. They never show up in the real world. Until Ulysses. Every superhero comes to us with a purpose. We don't always see it at first. Because we don't always know where to look. Flora! What is this? I am Ulysses, born anew. Holy unanticipated occurrences! Did you type this? He's a superhero. What? Do you have any enemies? I'm here about the squirrel. Danger lurks everywhere. Is he? He's flying. There was a change in the air. And the world was filling with excitement. Who's hungry? One now! Come on! People look to the skies for someone to save them. So the universe sent us... Ulysses. Okay, that's not really talking, but still! I have a picture in my head of a place. I don't know if it's real. But it has a feeling. And the feeling's real. Hi, my love. Hi, Dad. I wanted to talk to you about my graduation. Right, I'm gonna be there in the bleachers. I'm gonna see you in your... Let me, let me, Are how about I, I call you back? Okay. Taking the day off in here? The boss wants to see you. I get a whiskey? Double. You're real. Sorry? I want to tell you something really cool. You see all these people outside? They're not real. This is a simulation. You ready? There's my guy. Welcome home. This place is overwhelming. Dr. Isabel Clemens pioneered brain box simulations. Ugly, simulated worlds to generate appreciation for the real world. Now, why am I not remembering any of this? Don't worry about it. There I go. Most people say ignorance is bliss. But I say you have to experience the good to appreciate the bad. And the other way around. Exactly. I'm glad I caught you. Word on the street that there have been problems with Isabel's research. I'm a little disoriented. You're my guy. Dad. Graduation. I did not forget. It's been a crazy few days. You graduated two weeks ago. Ignore her. She's not real. She feels real. I'm scared. Your head's not on straight. It's almost like a trick being played. Greg, this is really bad. So how do we fix it? One of these days, you're going to have to choose between these worlds. It's amazing how easy humans can get used to even something spectacular. Erica, you haven't ever wished 
family would adopt you. Have you? Nope. Anybody who'd choose me would be pretty unusual. <gasps> we'll take this one. For the first time in my life, I'm being made to do something I don't want to do. Now then, let's you and I get a few things straight. My name is Bella Yaga. I'm a witch. Great! You agree that you'll teach me magic, and I agree to help you out. If you work really hard, I shan't do anything to hurt you. <gasps> a love potion for the boy next door? All of these are pretty useless to me. The spell I believe you're looking for is somewhere towards the back. Hang on, you actually talk? Of course I do, just not very often. In this household, there's one rule that's crucial. You must on no account for any reason ever dare disturb the Mandrake. Don't be rude. Don't disturb me. I'm here to say. What, A hole left by a witch can only be filled by a witch. I'll be learning magic. Well, so I was told. Can't wait to start. Years since the moon was hit. Electricity for only an hour a day, barely any food, and all you care about is Cosmo Ball. Ah! Ah! Attention. Unregistered teleportation. His power is unbelievable, beyond anything I have seen. All we have is now. I like you. I waited for this. <laughs> Stepping in here makes everyone nervous. You're not. The game is more dangerous than it may seem. All the hardships Earth faced are a result of the war with Cherno. We're about to go play football with what's essentially a nuclear bomb. And everyone else thinks this is just a game. Is that right? Pretty much it, yes. It's easier to risk your life when you know you're supported by millions. Even if they don't know the truth or understand the risk. Four young Earthlings with incredible powers. You show that there is something to be inspired by. Here we go! No! I want to share something with you. Like the masses. I was in awe when I first laid eyes on all the things you are. I heard that speech. I knew we make noise. I just thought it'd be in the streets. The Black Panthers are the single greatest threat to our national security. Our counterintelligence program must prevent the rise of a black messiah. You're looking at 18 months for the stolen car. Five years for impersonating a federal officer. Or you can go home. What do you want? Get close to Hampton. The Black Panthers are forming a rainbow coalition of oppressed brothers and sisters of every color. Neutralize him by any means necessary. America's on fire right now. And until that fire is extinguished, nothing else means a damn thing. Imagine what we could accomplish together. We can heal this whole city. You ain't tell me it was gonna be like this. These ain't no terrors. We got a rat, man. Does anybody else know about me? No one knows your identity. Are you sure? We educate, we nurture, we feed, and we lobby. 
perhaps we're here for more than just war with these bodies. We scream, and we shout, and we live by this anthem. But it's power to the people who really work their ransom. When I dedicated my life to people, I dedicated my life. You get to go out there and talk about dying a revolutionary death because you don't have another person growing inside your body. Anywhere there's people, there's power. My neighbor's passed out on the floor, and I can't feel her pulse. Does the little girl have any family members we can contact? Family members? I can hardly take care of myself. Come on, this is your responsibility. Grow up. Hey, music? I'm your sister. All she's got now is you. Hi there. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't. Music. It's your friend Ebo. I live next door. Can you move in? <laughs> she can understand everything you are saying to her. And if you are happy, press this one. I'm sad. Very funny, troublemaker. <laughs> she sees the world in a completely different way from us. We're about to have a pool party. I am happy. can do this. And I'm gonna help her just like she helps me. And I'm actually learning how to love because I love her. Tuesday, January 1st, 1856. With little pride and less hope, we begin the new year. Who is that? Good afternoon. I'm Tally. Abigail. I hope I'm not keeping you from something. I'm glad you've come. Meeting you has made my day. Oh. How pleasant and uncommon it is to make someone stay. I guess I'm supposed to offer a toast. What my husband means is he's so happy to finally get together. Do you miss me? Yes. Our farm is a slaughterhouse right now. My husband is killing his hawks. And I resolved to visit you so that there would be something in my day other than his meanness. So what do you think? What do you think about us? I don't know how to put it into words. It's been my experience that it's not always those who show the least who actually feel the least. Now well, seven, an earthquake knocked down our house in the barn. An earthquake? The dread never fully went away. What was safe if the solid earth could do that? I have certain expectations and you have certain duties. We shall sing like birds in a cage. We haven't seen you for days. Have you been ill? What is happening? Are you in danger? I would die without you. Do you know what memory it is that I most cherish? It's of your turning to me with that smile once you realized that you were loved. Astonishment and joy. Astonishment and joy. You are strong. You are important. You matter. Says 
What happened? Someone destroyed my house. Where's Carl? I think someone took him. Who would take Carl? Sue? <laughs> Local banker Carl Buttons abducted from his home in what appears to be a violent struggle. Hey, babe. Carl's in trouble. Turn on Channel 2 News. Is there anything you want to say to the people? I know you're out there, Carl. I know I'll see you again. <laughs> oh, shit. They kidnapped my brother. Should I get my gun? I'll get my gun. Mrs. Buttons, usually in a missing person case, people call the police before they call the media. Carl was such a sweet man. Why would anyone take him? This is a photo of me and Carl, in case you need it for all the press conferences. Can you think of someone who might want to harm your brother? Nope. Oh, dear. Nope, nope. People don't fear you. I can't trust you to handle my business if people don't fear you. Go, or I shoot you in the face with this gun. That's my vagina. You gonna shoot me in the vagina? No, I respect that area. <laughs> it's not nice to point guns at people. Carl isn't the guy who gets kidnapped. He's the guy who runs off on his wife. If this whole kidnapping thing is fake, you need to come clean. So if you did something, I can help you. Are you afraid? What? <laughs> yes. Knock, knock. We got a body. I am important. Answer this door! I am enough. Don't you think so? I think so, too. <laughs> it's been a weekend of horror in Yuba County. A weekend of chaos and loss. Can you, uh, not kill my vibe? It's a good day. Don't you think it's a good day? No! I've done nothing wrong. I just want my husband back. I swear these white bitches are crazy. It seems London is under attack. Several sky sharks. These are sharks, but they can fly, you say? between Paris and Lyon. No flying fish stands between me and my passengers. Put the skies under martial law. It's the only way that we can be safe. Continue to work on the solution. We are all locked in this psychological prison of burning aloneness. How's Linda? She's somewhere in the house. Is there some type of issue? Ah! We are fine. Not only is everything not okay, nothing is okay. Linda said she was planning to end our thing. Nobody wants to live alone. For two weeks, we are locked together here. You know, you think I'm so happy and normal. No, I, I'd never accuse you of being happy and normal. Because I'm not! I've been furloughed. Now there is literally zero purpose to my life. I'm going to get provisions. We need milk, bread. Wait, how many asses have you got? Piss off. The nice people that I fired, they were fired because of me. It's not about the virus, it's about who I am and what I do for a living. You fired them well. Thank you. Is that a glass of wine? Yes, yeah, it is. <laughs> We have a situation, Perkson, and all the major department stores are closing. They want everything out of the next four days. We have a problem. At Harrods, we have $4 million worth of jewelry. Someone's going to have to pack the valuables up. I believe you are a man who can be trusted. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I can be trusted. It's going to have to be someone that we trust, so that means inevitably it's going to be me. It's a new dawn. What are you taking out of Harrods? A diamond. It's a new day. Since lockdown, I'm looking back at myself like that was then, and this is now. Yeah. The bastards who told me to fire those people, they are bad. You and I are good, and good is better than bad. You're talking about stealing a diamond. Three million pounds. Live wild or die, Linda. And I'm feeling good. Carrots is the most glamorous store in the world. I know all the security guards. I know the security systems. 
I just need to get the gentleman's name. His name? Edgar Allan Poe. Edgar Allan Poe! Wow! What can go wrong? Locked down one last ride. Oh, Lord of art in heaven. Oh, my God, my God! Forgive us the sin of deception. Who'd have thought a month ago we'd be doing this? Not me. And I'm feeling good. Ready for tonight? I'm as ready as a person can be. After the fight, we're all coming back here for the champs of victory, Paul. Don't be late. Minister Malcolm X. Good news, the chariot is coming. You know I'm the greatest. That's right. Jim Brown takes the ball. Your record is going to stand the test of time. How's everybody feeling tonight? All together, yeah. <laughs> New heavyweight champion of the world. Hey, champ, you don't suppose you could sign an autograph? Yeah, of course, man. Give him an autograph, Jim. Actually, Mr. Cook. <laughs> oh, shut sure thing, brother. Oh, yeah, that's the Don't you think it's about time to party? Tonight is a chance for us to reflect. Hey. You mean no one else is coming? Well, this is all to a hopping start. <laughs> You all are a bright and shining future. You need to understand what is at stake here. Everything's not so black and white like you make it out to be. But we are fighting for our lives. You know I know what's going on out there, right? Listen, listen. Brothers and sisters, listen, listen, listen. Miami, the champ! I swear we'll never find a way to where we're going all alone. The goal is for us to really be free. We want a world where we're safe to be ourselves. Without having to answer to anybody forward. We have to be there for each other. Who's the greatest? You brothers could move mountains without lifting a finger. Senior Sergeant Kalashnikov. The Red Army needs a good submachine gun. It's been said you have no real education. We would have to pull men and material from other projects to focus on yours, but that is not an option here. Rumor has it you're designing a submachine gun, is that right? Yeah, but Andrej said that hey, I... Andrej was talking about working hours. The war is not yet over. Was it just a complete waste of time?